Hello, this is Robert Smith. I'm here in Alcatraz. Actually, I'm in a cell. And I thought I'd share a, uh, a, a concept that may help you understand some things about ourselves and about our world. Even though we're in, uh, this is a prison, you know. And in times in our lives, sometimes we do feel like we're in a prison, stuck, trapped, feel like there's no way out. But, you know, the interesting thing about life, oftentimes we're in a place we don't want to be. We don't know what to do. We don't know where to go or even how to help change our life. And so there was a book that I was reading uh, by Viktor Frankl. And it's the meaning, I believe it's called The Meaning of Life. And he was in prison, actually a concentration camp, where they beat him, they starved him, and they did all kinds of weird things. But what he did inside of his mind and how to handle and process his current life situation. And what we want to do with what we've learned here with Faster EMT is the ability to take control of what you think and how you feel. And so one of the things that we teach is, you know, we use the tapping and we talk about aiming, we're talking about going inside you. But the most important thing is to realize it's not where you are that determines how you feel, but it's what you do within yourself that determines how you feel. And so what we want to do is learn how to take control of our inner world and our thinking processes. And when we do this, everything starts to change. You know, oftentimes what we want to do with our life is if we're in a bad situation, we want to pack up and run. And then of course, what I have discovered while working with people is that when you pack up and run, you still take the stuff with you. You take the emotional hurts and the pains and the experiences with you. And as you take these with you, then you start to operate. And then you start to pick people who help you stay in alignment with the stuff you said you didn't want. And so one of the most important things, what I teach, is make peace wherever you are. You know, if you're in a relationship and you feel trapped and stuck and you're just ready to dump it, but guys, I suggest clean you up first. Clean out the pain, clean out the hurt, change how you see this whole situation. And as you do that, what's gonna happen is, it's one, you'll be healing, you'll leave the pain in the past and you'll start transforming. And that's the most important thing that you can understand. Because, you know, I was raised in Oklahoma and there was horses, ranches, and out in Binger, Oklahoma, actually, out in the country. You know, the first closest neighbor was a mile away. And they, were, they had horses. And one thing I noticed about what farmers would do with these horses is they would, they would stretch this wire all around the perimeter where they'd like for the horse to stay. And they'd have an electrical charge there. Now, it wasn't a hurtful charge. If it, I rubbed against it one time, it was a little zap. But it just let the horses know where they should stay at. And then oftentimes they'll take these horses and they'll go to shows. And what they'll even do, they'll stretch a string around a perimeter. Not electrical charge, but a string. And these horses were smart enough to stay within the perimeters of a string. Now that's the interesting thing about us is that we've had bad experiences in the past and if you don't change what you hold within you about your past, this invisible string of pain and hurt from the past, which is no longer real, no longer in existence, but inside those who hold it. And once you discover that your memories and your pains are from the past and they're not real, you can break the string and free yourself. No matter where you are, no matter where you go, wherever you go, you are the one who's given the meaning. This is an amazing place, a place that many things have occurred here. And you know, people ask me, well, did you feel the energy? And I said, I brought my energy with me. Because I see energy is just merely emotions, feelings, sensations, attitudes, beliefs, and behaviors. Now somebody else could be here and they could be feeling bad things. But again, where are the bad things coming from? Inside those who produce it. So make peace with your past, free yourself, and rediscover wherever you are, you are free. Free to feel anything you choose and take control. So just realize that you're free. Now you, you know, life deals you things, events and experiences, and from these experiences, you give the meaning to it. So now, let every experience be a rock for you to stand on for yourself. Discover the power, personal power, 
and take control of your life. This is Robert Smith here in Alcatraz, San Francisco Bay, just right outside. And I hope this helps you. And just remember, go to your experiences, see the person that bothers you, that you feel like you're trapped with, and change how you feel about it. It doesn't fix them, but it will help you learn how to heal yourself. And then as you heal yourself, then you always can make better decisions because I've seen it before. You bail, and then you go and you find another one just like them. And oftentimes you pick a better one that's even worse than the ones that you were with in the first place. So anyway, this is Robert Smith, and we'll talk to you later. Ciao. Free yourself from the inside out. Peace.